Hi guys and welcome to Maya Night. This is a... Uh, I'm playing on a mod pack through the Technic Launcher, which is called the Realm of Maya Night, which supposedly has every single uh, every single mod that the, the guys that are playing Maya Night at the moment. Sparkles, Jericho, Syndicate, Sonya and everybody else are playing with. So because they haven't released the seed for that, I've actually just started up a brand new world. As you can see, I collected a few bits of dirt and a few saplings just to test my audio because I'm actually using OBS at the minute. I got really frustrated. Thanks. I forgot that that was in this. I don't think it's in the one they're playing. I think they might have disabled it because it's annoying as hell. But um, every time you get an achievement, they give you some fireworks, which is nice. Um, Yeah, so what was I saying? Blah blah, Sonia, Syndicate. I can't even remember what I was saying. Oh yeah, OBS. I'm using OBS because I was getting really annoyed with Bandicam. Just being a pain in the arse, basically. And my webcam quality through Bandicam was terrible. And I don't really know why. Because I bought the Logitech C920. I had to actually look and see what it was then. The C920, which is what 90% of the gamers that I watch use because of because of its lovely 1080p quality. But yeah, so for some reason it was coming out at like 480p, the webcam, but I think it was because I was running the web, like I was putting a webcam overlay through Bandicam, so I think I was asking it to do slightly too much, but fingers crossed this video comes out okay. I literally haven't, I've tested it a million times and every time it's done something slightly weird, slightly different. So the sync might be slightly out with the uh, microphone and the webcam, which now I've mentioned it, you're all going to notice, but... If it is, I'll try and fix it for the next episode, but this is literally just a test episode. I apologise for being gone for so long. You can probably hear it in my voice still now. I haven't been very well for the last, like, three weeks, but that really isn't an excuse for the last, like, two months I haven't been here. I apologise for that. I kind of... I had... I'll explain what I said to, like, everybody else who was asking me about the videos. I had all these games, and I had the means to record them, and the time, and everything else. I just I just didn't know what games to play and I kind of sat there and I was like I don't want to play any of the games I actually have which was really bad oh what's that oh ah, great petal anyway um yeah so I had all these games and I just didn't I just didn't feel the inclination to play any of them unfortunately but we are back with my night I mean I have been binge watching Jericho's point of view from my night and it's pretty cool I like the mod packs because again I was getting slightly oh go away I was getting slightly bored with normal Minecraft. So I thought I'd try some modded Minecraft and then I saw the mod packs that the Mayanite gang were using and they all look pretty cool. And also I've started watching Waglington's point of view because you don't really hear a lot from him in the like in Jericho's episodes and things like that on the streams. But he is there, he is playing. I have watched a few of his videos. And it's quite easy to tell that he lives in England. Or I'm assuming he lives in England. He is English. I don't know if he still lives in England. But his upload speed is terrible. So I think that's why he can't stream. He just puts like highlight videos up. But that's my problem too. If I had anywhere near a decent upload speed. I mean ours at the minute is laughable. My upload speed is like 0 0.6 megabytes per second. Which is hilarious when you get people... Like, some of the gamers going, oh, I've only got 250 megabytes per second. That's so shit. And I'm like, wow. wow I, I could only dream of these things. But yeah, so I have a really terrible upload speed. Which is preventing me from streaming. And it means that uploading these videos takes for bloody ever. Even for, like, a 15-minute video. It's crazy. It takes me, like, four hours. Which is really not cool. All right, I have beans. Can I plant these? Anyway, I'm trying to find a suitable place to put my house because every time I've played this, because I've been playing this like sort of off camera uh, for a little while now, and I was trying to decide whether I wanted to um, actually make a, make a, what's the word? Not video. Make a series. Sorry, series. Uh, this, I kind of want to live here. Like, because I always choose flat areas because I can't build for shit. So. Oh, and there's some gravel, iron gravel stuff. So, I would assume... I want to eat this okra, whatever that is. Whatever it is, I'm hungry and I need it. Um, So, I'm assuming that anybody, or most of you that come here and have seen this video or are watching this video right now... Wow, my you can tell I haven't done this in a while. My brain is not working. Um, Yeah, you can 
What? I don't know what I was saying. Just ignore me. I'm losing the plot slowly but surely. Um, no, anyway. If you guys are here, I'm assuming it's because it is to do with my night or you probably found it while searching for my night. Hopefully, if I do my um, if I do my tags and everything correctly. But yeah, hopefully you guys have found this through my night or maybe you just found it by accident. Maybe you're a hardcore subscriber that stuck with me through all this drought of videos. But anyway... If you are new to this concept, then I will be explaining some of what I do, but if you could just help me by leaving in the comments how much you know about the mods that are included. I mean, I'm not going to sort of say I'm doing this and I'm doing that and I'm doing the other, like right now, I'm going to choose the mod packs that I'm going to feature more heavily at a later date, maybe in a couple of episodes time, while we just gather general resources that we could use for anything. If you guys could let me know what you know about the mod pack and maybe even what you want to see. So what mods you want me to focus on. I mean, I definitely want to look into the blood magic because that looks hilariously fun. Right, I need beans. Yeah, that looks really good. And what else was I going to look into? Ars Magica, but that looks like a pain in the ass to like understand. So I might have to do some reading on that. Although I have been, like I said, watching Waglington and he's been explaining a lot of what he's doing as he's doing it. Right, I need to plant my sugar cane because, oops, because we will always need sugar cane. Well, nearly always. I'm going to put that there. This is the best farm ever, by the way. Don't judge. So, oh God, it's already getting dark. This is what I get for fannying around and not starting the recording. Like at the same time as the actual save file. Because I had to start and mess around and try and make sure all my levels were all right. But... As I was saying, when I've been playing this on my own time, every single time I've started on the night of a blood moon. If you guys don't know what a blood moon is, I think I would have got the um, notification by now, so I think we might be safe. But if you're not aware of what a blood moon is, when one appears, you will bloody well know about it. It is horrible. It's basically like millions of millions and millions of nasty mobs that hate the world and hate life and just hate everything and they just want to murder you. And it's really not great. So for those of you that might not know a lot about this or these mods in general, this is a tinkerer's block, but you can use it as normal iron. So basically with the gravel ores, it's basically the same as a normal ore. So because it is iron gravel ore, I had to have the same level as I would need to mine iron. So I needed a stone. So you obviously need a stone pickaxe to mine iron. So I needed a stone shovel to mine iron ore, but it works the same way as normal iron ore. Sorry, not using my brain again. Um, so yes, yeah, so you can just smelt it in here. Uh, um, sorry, <laughs> where'd that go? Give it back. Thank you. Anyway, I can just smelt it in there. And we will have iron. I'm going to make an iron sword because I can already see some creepies on my mini map in the top right. I just realized my, uh, my webcam is bottom left. I don't know if that's going to be a problem. I don't think it is. Anyway, I'm going to make a sword first because I'm kind of scared for my life. Right, so. Sword. So noisy. So noisy. Go away. Go away. Right, I want to find... Actually, I need to... Waypoint this for home. Make it blue. So I want an axe actually because the tree capitator, I don't know if it's actually the tree capitator mod on here or it's something that does the exact same thing, it is on here so if you mine the bottom of a tree it will use the same amount of durability as it would to chop down the whole tree but if you mine the bottom block or a block underneath, like a block with blocks on top of it, I'm not explaining this in the best way, then it will destroy the whole thing all at once but it does take a little while because it takes the same amount of time as it would if you are doing it normally I think and it also takes the same amount of durability. These plants from Pneumatic Craft, I'm really not sure what they do. I've seen a few, again, on my other world I've been playing, that I don't know when they choose to work because they're, like, 100% maturely grown and then you just don't get anything from them. And sometimes, like, you randomly get, like, a squid or something because there are squid plants and slime plants, slime plants, slime plants and things like that, which just sometimes work and sometimes don't. So I don't really know how, what the criteria is for those. Ow! No, 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 no. If you're a Gatling skeleton, we're not going to be... No, you can't be a Gatling skeleton. Ow! Oh, you are. Oh, you are. You dickhead. You dick. Were you just like... The second word is off. Oh, no, no, no. 
Doom Creeper. Ha! Ha! Ow! This is not going well. <gasps> what the f- Okay, so Gatling Skeleton, if you could just kindly fuck off, and that would be great. I'm- he's gonna kill me, I'm gonna die. This is not fair. Just fuck off. Ow! Jesus! gonna sit here and die starvation how shit is this i don't want to die in the water okay i was gonna say mm, go away i was gonna say i don't want to die in the water because then i'll have trouble getting my stuff back fucking hell oh uh, yeah this place is not a nice one i don't actually know where the gatling skeleton comes from like what mod it's from but it's an asshole and i don't like it and i don't want to play and there's so much stuff under water hmm don't really know how I'm going to deal with this because he's still going to be there when I get back. Hum, hum, hum. So as sad as this is, I think I'm literally going to have to go on a mining expedition, like pretty much start again and get like a a wooden a wooden pickaxe and a wooden sword and everything and go on a mining expedition until sunrise and hope that it burns to death like everybody else. I'm going to go up there and get some tree stuff because one of the good things about this is if you die your uh, your possessions go into a grave and then all you need to do is break that grave with either your fist or pickaxes quicker but it doesn't really wow I'm making a really shit job of getting up here um yeah so you can break your grave with either your fist or pickaxes quicker and all of your items just plop out basically so there's no danger of them despawning which is good oh cows I may need to uh need to murder you for science because that's always the problem I find with this mod pack is getting a reliable source of food is a right pain in the ass, which was very English of me it sounded very English of me anyway but yeah so I think I'm not entirely sure how long this has been going but I'm gonna cut try and cut down my video lengths slightly just so it helps with upload speed I mean if I cut down the length even to like 15 minutes it's going to mean that there's going to be twice as many videos going up pretty much which is always a good thing I'm sure I really hope this has worked because if I've just been like talking to myself for the last god knows how long I'm not going to be a happy bunny I'm like going to be a very angry bunny right pickaxe just go and mine some random shizzle kind of oh, okay Okay. Will you just go away? Thank you. Oh, that's lava, so we're not going to go in there. Oh, oh, oh! Don't. I swear, if you are a Gatling dickhead like that last one. <sighs> Will you go? No! Don't you dare kill me! Don't you actually dare! Thank you, you absolute dick. Oh, I don't want to be anyone's fucking friend anymore. As you will see up there, there is a mod which... <laughs> which means that loads of popular YouTubers are in this as NPCs, but in the night time... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, this is not going well. In the night time, they get very grumpy they turn into very grumpy npcs and they will pretty much try and kill you instantly i'm gonna try and get underground before i get murdered which is never what we want although it's already happened once which is great we're gonna we're gonna do the manly thing and hide oh i don't have any bugger 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 i don't have any coal this could be an issue and i bet this video is dark as hell at this very moment in time i do apologize uh oh i haven't got enough spruce uh oh gonna... you can see me dying already i need wood wood gotta be really quiet so no one sees us because they can all just fuck off where do i go him on my mip map but i don't know where he is although it does look like the sun 
would start to rise very soon. Um, do not kill me, whatever you do, otherwise I'm going to be so mad. This is so mad. I don't even think that's going to be enough to start regening my health, but oh well. At least it's getting daytime soon. Very, very, very soon. We need to work on making some shears, actually, to uh, shear those sheep. No, no, no! Oh, no! Eh. 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 Just die. I don't want to be a friend. I don't want to be a friend. Uh-oh, I hear a baby zombie. Life is about to get real difficult. Ow! Uh-oh. Goodbye, cruel world! Don't you dare! Don't you fucking do it. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Oh my god, that was a cow. God, I literally nearly shit my pants. That was terrifying. Can I please just eat this and start regening health? Like, is that a thing that can happen right now? Nope. No one in. <sighs> right, I'm gonna leave this here actually for later use. Let's see if we can get our stuff back quickly before we end the episode. Wow, that was a very quick backup. Ah! No! Creeper! No. But no, I need slime. I need slime. What the fuck was that noise? I don't even know. I need- Oh, uh, spiders. I need slime. Don't tell me he's still there. Anyway, I need slime. Real bad. Because slime helps you make a fish trap, and then fish trap is basically infinite food. And boom. End game. Ooh! Actually, I've just had an idea. So, oh shit, I'm such an idiot. Wow, how many of you were screaming at me pretty much then? Because I'd put them above the water. Wow, I'm so clever. I'm so clever, guys. I'm really not. But bones are very useful, actually, because I don't know what mod it is. It must be something to do with the food. But um, one of the mods, actually, if you have like bone meal, if you bone meal something pretty much to death, then um, it'll replant the seed that you get, so you can just keep spamming the bone meal and it just keep replanting it. Right. I want this back, please. This is going to take forever because we're underwater. Give me all my things back so I can go and sit and cry in a hole about how terrible this first day has been for me. Okay. So, iron sword. Need that. So, do, do, do. what else did we want? This. I want to put all my bloody farm things back again because I was such an idiot the first time just give me more seeds and I will be happy or I need to go fix my farm because I'm an idiot there's no better way of no better way of explaining that oh there's more iron gravel debris thing over there and I did see there's some iron under here which we can get nothing kills us first I'm such an idiot. And if you guys didn't pick up on that, then you're a bit silly too. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I love you really. Seeds. This is what we want. And also cotton seeds are very useful. They grow cotton, quite obviously. But the cotton can be used to make string and wool. Oh yeah, and there's also, with the, uh, what's it called mod? can't remember what it's called. It's to do with auto sorting everything. I can't even remember what it's called. Oh, inventory tweaks, that's the one. Because of it, I think it's inventory tweaks that does it anyway. But when you run out of something, so say I have a stone pickaxe here and a stone pickaxe in my inventory. If my stone pickaxe breaks, then it'll automatically refill it with the one that's in my inventory so I don't have to like switch it out. Which I think is really, really super helpful and it's something that Minecraft could probably use. Like vanilla Minecraft, right? I want you. So as you can see, if I just keep right clicking, it just replants the seed. Right, so that will do for now. Right. So. Oh, what the fuck do you want? It's daytime. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. I was going to say, this is not how we're going out. This video has been going a lot longer than I anticipated. Whoops. 
Right, so we need some wheat. I hate it when people say it like that. Oh, we had more seeds. Of course we did. Right, bread. Give me bread. Uh, don't earn enough to regen. Uh, how do we make it? Right, if I make slabs and then... Is it that? No. That. No. This. Yes. Okay. Drying racks are very useful. They will soon become your best friend, as will zombie flesh, which is quite funny. I'm going to put this up here. But basically, what you do is you hang your rotten flesh on there. You can actually hang anything on there, which I noticed the other day, which is quite cool. But this will dry out and it will turn into monster jerky, which you can just eat pain free. And it actually restores quite a lot of your hunger. I'm going to wait for that to do its thing. But anyway, I'm going to end off the episode here. Possibly go get myself some more food kill some pigs something like that anyway i'm gonna end the episode here hopefully you've enjoyed it and hopefully it's all worked out okay fingers crossed obs please be nice so i will see you on the next episode so don't forget to comment below what you thought of the episode whether you want to see more of it and what mods you think i should delve into anyway i will see you all very soon thank you very much for watching bye guys